Yeah, 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 yeah. Black and yellow on my jersey. Yeah, the still is we shutting it down. King of my city, I'm taking the crown. We putting in work without making a sound. And we came from the bottom. Yeah, we got them sick like the flu. Uh. What's going on, guys? Oh, you're not up, fellas. There is strong. Comment it down below right now. There is strong. And then there is Carson Strong. I love you all. Kill like button on this franchise if you guys are enjoying this as much as I am enjoying, enjoying making it. Ladies and gentlemen, ba-bam, look on the screen. We're currently 6-4. and four. It's been a bit of a tough season. Um, I'm not going to lie. We got a rookie quarterback. We've had ups, downs, lefts, rights. There's been tough games. Started off the year 0-2 against two really good opponents. Bounced back with three. Lost two. And now we've bounced back with three in a row. But our season, like I said, it's been up, down. Carson Strong's looking really, really, really good. There's a lot of things to really be happy about um, on our team. Our rookie, Justin Ross, who a lot of people were mad at me for that Devin Bush trade. Understandably, I just felt like our defense was good enough. I don't know if you can still be mad at me for that trade. I have a 6'4", 210-pound rookie with superstar development and road tech. Feel like that was one of the best decisions I could have made. Chase Claypool's having a really, really good year. But... We're starting off this video with a big time divisional game against Cincy. Honestly, this is the biggest game of the year. You you, you won't convince me differently. Um, in every sense, we got to beat them. And the main reason, like just to keep it simple, is I don't necessarily know that we are going to make the playoffs. I'm going to run outside for that. I don't know necessarily that we're going to make the playoffs if we don't win our division. That is how rough of a year we have had. We're 6-4. and four. In a tough conference, you don't always get the wild card of that. I got to make sure that I push the Bengals so far down in the standings that he can't even see straight. Boom, bam, Chase Claypool. You'll love to see it. Okay, his deep threat is kind of what I've been working on all season. Uh, he's up to an 86. He's just overall been playing super, super good. The idea is it's Steelers football. We're big. We're tough. He's six foot four. Um, Justin Ross is six foot four, and then Juju's I think like six point six two, but a big, big, big receiver. And then we got a running back who's huge in Najee Harris. And then to just like it's, sum up the team even more, we got the rookie six four, two hundred and fifteen pound pocket passer in Carson Strong. Now he's had a pretty good year so far. Like I said, he's a rookie. We're having we've asked a lot of him, and he's done a lot of good things. Seventeen picks, so not crazy good on that. Low completion percentage. But he's our guy. I see him as a three, four year down the road. This is going to be our guy. He is our quarterback. I have no doubt in my mind about that. He is the man. As far as scouting, I'm going to do some scouting real quick. Sorry, guys, if this is taking longer than you expected. Positions of need. Honestly, Juju, I've scouted a lot of these. Um, a big one is offensive line. I've kind of started to look at tackles, but I just, Donovan Godfrey, I want to start looking just at a good amount of these offensive linemen because I feel like you can't go wrong with it. We're a young team. We're really, really good on the defensive front. We drafted really, really well on that. Um, cornerback, it would always be nice. I'd love to bring in, we have Gidry and a couple of, but I'd love to bring in a marquee rookie corner who can kind of grow with this team and get better with this team because I do feel like we don't have it. Um, oh, that's that's a good that's a good find there in Sterling. Um, but anyways, ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, this is a massive game against the Bengals. We got to lock up. We got to be smart. We got to play effectively. I cannot make mistakes. We got a bye week next week. So important that we go in here, do our thing. He's got Joe Burrow, Joe Mixon, Calvin Ridley, T. Higgins. He's got a good receiving core. Ladies and gentlemen, let's dance. Oh shoot! Good run. Dive at his feet. Dive at his feet. It's okay. Oh, it's going to be bunch tight end all game. What? Way over. I got stuck. Yo, what a click on to what? Dive at his feet. Oh, okay. Yep. That's a, that's a good throw. Yep. Make a play, OB. Why he's there for his height against this? Okay, I gotta switch to match defense or something. He's he's doing a good job right now. Yep, come on, Minka. Okay, good freaking drive. I'm trying. He doesn't have anyone who's gonna burn Gidry across it. I feel like I might be able to do a little bit of man blessing, but he mixed it up really well right there. Carson and Najee, let's let's go. Let's go, Najee. 
Let's go, Najee. Let's go, Harris. Ooh, one tap. Okay. I don't love the defense. I, well, I do love the defense that he's in right now. I think he's playing this not aggressive enough. Okay, wait. Let me eye for him to the slot. Let's just go slot stretch. This is a bit more powerful on the on the weak side. And I do feel like if we can just get one kick out block, we could be gone. I messed up. Yeah, I'm, I'm running this ball third and two. I trust Najee Harris, and I shouldn't. Come on, Harris. Oh, we cannot have that in a big divisional game. Okay, I, I need him to move his people up. Move up, man. Move up. Move up. Take a risk here. Take a risk. He's screaming at us. That's on me. Waited way too long, Carson. Come on, make a play. Yo, what is going on, D-Line? Oh my gosh. Come on, let's go, Harris. Let's go, Harris. Good run. I'm hitting him with a good play fake here. I got nobody. Come back to the ball. Oh my gosh. He's taunting. Oh my goodness. I, f I fell for it. And I... Oof. No way he just ran the ball. Let's go! Good job, defense! Good job. Hey, Carson, get on the field. I Najee Harris, I don't know what to say. Like, I... How many... Like, we've had back-to-back -back drives where we've had the third and two, and because we just literally are... Not able to get that yard. I'm just got to go to the passing game. Other problem is our disadvantage is so bad. Okay, I'm going to try a draw here just to see if I can just get him going a little bit. Like, it doesn't have to. The thing is, at this stage of the game, it doesn't have to be anything crazy. I just got to get him going a tiny bit. Okay, look for, look for Juju here or Justin Ross straight up. Good throw, Carson. That's anticipation. That is how you anticipate... A throw. Hurry it up. We need, we need, need, need points right now. Ooh, I think I got Justin Ross. Yeah, I do. Carson Strong, baby. Good throw, Carson. Good throw, Carson. Let's go. Get me out of there. Come on, Brett. Laser. Laser, let's go! Come on! Good throw, Carson. And Harris is helping out in other ways. Honestly, the run game's not working. That is a laser in between the zones. He's dropping his whole team back. We get ball at half. Remember, we get ball at half. We got a chance if I can stop him here to make this a three-point game. No quit. Absolutely no quit. Carson, his favorite target. Let's go, Justin Ross. He's dropping everybody back, dude. He's dropping everybody back. It's, it's infuriating, but it is what it is. Okay. Let's go, Harris. That's going to mess him up because, like you can see, he's, draw he's just playing max coverage every single play. So it's got to mess him up a little bit when he sees that draw play coming. Like right there, boom. Come on, Harris, good run. Justin Ross, baby. Justin Ross, baby, let's go. Not the games when you're up big, it's the games when you're down big and you come back and freaking win it. Let's go, Carson! Good play, Carson Strong. Come on, Carson Strong, good stuff. Okay, battle it out. Defensive-wise, I feel like I have a decent idea of his raise. I know what to take away, and I know when he passes out of that set, I just got to guard that hook. I feel like I can get a crazy lurk with Minka on that hook. I really do. Okay, you know, actually, wait. No, I don't want him in a hook zone. I need him in, I need him playing that 10-yard. Yeah, that's bagged, bro. That's bagged. That's bagged! No! Let's go! Way to recover! 
Way to recover. Let's go, man. Boom box. Okay. Just get out the gym, Harris. Everybody block for him, man. Everybody block for him. That's okay. Just block. Every what? Everyone get up there and block for him. Go, Harris! Good run, Harris. That's some vintage. That is some vintage 2021 year one Harris right there. Okay, I need everyone to go to that side, and then I need to just... Oh, I might... Okay, he's confused. Only thing I can do here is just do a quick flip of the play. And then now I have a pretty good matchup here. I think I have this left side dominated. Yeah. Go for a run, Harris. That's all right. Okay, I got, I got Snell in. There's no way he is expecting a run right here. There's no way he's expecting a run. I'm, I'm, running, I'm running a draw, though. Come on, Snell. Snell! Good job, Snell! You're gonna come out in goal line. I'm gonna have a weak side toss here to Najee Harris. I'm certain of it. And he's gonna walk into that end zone. Dang it, man. Oof. I thought he was gonna break that second. Okay, the way our defense is playing, I have no regrets in taking the points right there. Zero regrets. That's all right. I actually was kind of hoping he might do that. That's going to give me a chance here on this fourth down to just, or on this third down to just scream at him. He hasn't seen man all game. Oh my gosh. That's an overthrow. Oh gosh, Burrow. Okay. Begged. Bag. Let's go, defense! Okay, I'm looking Justin Ross deep here. I think there's a chance that he's open. Everyone's blitzing, which means I got Eric Ebron. Easy money, Ebron. I, I'm, I'm running a draw right now. I don't, I don't care. He, he may be ready for it. I'm running a draw with the best running back in the freaking world. Let's go, Harris. Come on, Justin Ross. Just seal that edge, please. Oh my goodness. Come on, Ebron. Let's go, Ebron. Oh my gosh. Oh, wow. End the game. End the game. Oh my goodness. Tackle him. I did not get a chance to deep half. I did not get a chance to deep half. And he, he throws a dot. Yo, stay in bounds. Stay in bounds. This is something weird. The splits are weird here. The splits are super weird. That's a laser. I used it the wrong guy. Oh my goodness. Oh, I want to blitz him so bad. It's not even funny. Okay, just watch the running guy. Oh! Oh my gosh. If they go down and kick a field goal, the other team gets a possession to either match it. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, let's dance. On third and short, they'll try and pick it up through the air, escaping the pressure right. Now he's going to throw deep right side. Justin! Oh my gosh. They'll set up to throw. Carson, baby. Carson, let's go. They run again with Harris. And he is going to be on the give. This is Harris. And he will have the first. When, when OT's done, OT's done. When OT's done, OT's done. That, that should be GG. Bam! Let's go, fellas! It's division, man. Hey, it's the division. You taunted me. I, I didn't want to have to do that to him. I didn't want to have to do it to him, but I had to do it to him. I've, I've been killed so many times. So in, in CFMs, when OT is done, OT is done. That first round. But just like in the NFL, you have 15 minutes. The thing is in the CFM, though, you only have five-minute overtime periods. So if I can run the clock down and get a field goal, he never gets a chance to get the football. That's why getting the ball is so important, and it's important to run clock. 
I needed that game more than you guys will ever understand. Huge game from Najee Harris. Back in the lead uh, for the best running back in the NFL. Carson Strong doing it. Yo, he's the passing leader right now? Oh my gosh, Carson. Okay. We throw the ball a ton. I'm going to see you guys soon. We got a bye week. I'm going to see you guys in a couple weeks in the same video. Holy doly, I needed that game. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, Bubba Bam, fellas, we are back. Holy schmoly. Okay, first thing I want to start off by saying is the Bengals lost. During the bye week, the Bengals did end up losing. That is literally music to my ears. Let's have a look at the playoff picture, kind of see where we stand. Currently, the number four seed. No shock there. Um, Bengals aren't in the playoffs. I got to maintain the control of this division. I got to keep winning. I have the Browns in a couple weeks. The Eagles, who I don't think have the best record. But this game against the Patriots here is big for many, many, many reasons. The Patriots are currently a playoff team. I don't believe that. They're not the division. Oh, they're not a play. See, that's wild. Oh, my gosh. That's wild. Okay, so take this in. At 8-4, and four, the Patriots are not a playoff team. If I don't win my division, I better just walk somewhere and never like and literally there's I don't even know what this is I don't know where this analogy is going but if I don't win that division I am in so much trouble that last win we had was so huge okay let's go to weekly strategy Heidi what are you doing my dog is in here uh Mac Jones we're going up against Mac Jones really good passes are rating everywhere I'm gonna go defend deep pass because I do find the short pass I can do a pretty good job with Minka as far as our offensive attack, run the ball. Carson Strong's done good, but I don't ideally want Carson Strong throwing the ball 25 times a game. I want Carson Strong throwing the ball maybe 15 times a game. This is Najee Harris's squad. He needs to be the leader of this team. He needs to be moving the ball. Let's see what kind of upgrades we get. Holy schmoly, it's Christmas. Okay, abilities. Now, now what's his, what does he get grab and go at? 80 overall slot. Now, how far away is he from that? Ooh, he's a long way from that. Okay, is there anything that he can get here? Soon 80, everything's 85. You know what? I, I think I'm just going to upgrade his deep threat at this point and cross our fingers that we can get him deep out elite at some point. That's like Moss's face. That's a great ability. Plus two catching. He has been so good for us. Javelin, J Javelin Gidry, he gets an upgrade. I'm going to upgrade his slot abilities. Let's see what that's going to take us. Awareness. Plus two man, player recognition, and you can't forget, I did get him to start development, which was crazy. Lorenzo Card has been so good for us. Great free agent pickup. Didn't cost me a lot of money. Let's go, Lorenzo. Plus one speed, 89 speed now. And Najee Harris. Oh my gosh, it's Christmas. It is Christmas, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, ball carry vision, carrying, and spin move. Now, Adam Anderson, he's a rookie. Uh, like a third round pick, absolute stud, been great for us. Star development, that's plus one finesse move. He's had a good rookie season, lots of sacks. He's been in a lot of crucial situations for us and he's done ridiculously well. Could not be happy with him. Other things that we're just gonna quickly look at is the Patriots roster before we hop in this game. I hope, I don't know, do you guys like this? I like to just try and take a little time of in between games to really think. We got Mac Attack, Harris. Yo, I think I can press him. He does have a good rookie there in John Mechie. Yeah, John Mechie the third is a beast. That's a good pickup that he has right there. And then defensively, he's still got Gilmore, the Gilly Lock, good safeties. Yeah, he's he's got a solid team. It's definitely not going to be easy. As far as scouting, I'm trying to do this between every single one because we're it it seems tedious now, and I get that it is tedious. But you guys are gonna thank me big time later when the draft comes, and we're laughing as we are selecting someone in like late that has crazy good potential. Um, that's late sixth rounder. One thing I'm gonna do now, I just wanna go here and I just wanna start going through these. Figuring out, and just in, just in, more so so I don't draft them. Figuring out who here is like the contenders in the prairie. Running back, you won't see me draft on the running back unless it's someone ridiculously fast. Uh, middle linebacker, always interested in, but not too much. Terrence Williams, let's scout him. He's got a late first round grade. Rashawn Lake, let's shout him. He's late first rounder. Tight ends, not super worried about tight ends. Ebron's locked up for two or three years. This draft seems deep. This draft seems really, really, really good. And I am all about picking up better defensive players. Ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, it's showtime. Uh, currently, Najee Harris is second in the league in rushing. Justin Ross, third in receiving. Let's go. It's a play fake. Watch that delay fade. Delay fade. Let's go. I knew it was coming. Good job to it. Let's dance, bro. Let's freaking dance. Okay, now he's an eye form close. Okay, he's staying under center. Honestly, if people are going to go under center on me, 
I feel so confident in my edge rushers, rushers that Anderson and TJ Watt are going to make that miserable for you. Like, I am so certain that one of those guys will get to you. Just right there. Bam! Let's go, defense! Good job, Minka. I spun the wrong way, but good job, Minka. Okay, let's go simple here. Yeah. Get him. Come on, Justin Ross. Let's go, Justin. Hey, Najee. Get in the end zone, Najee Harris. Let's dance, fellas. That's a defensive touchdown. That's the pressure that Watt and Anderson were getting on Mac Jones caused that 1,000%. Great freaking defense. I feel really good today. Good play. I tried. I pressed circle to click on there. It didn't let me shoot. Yo, someone get to him. Anderson, one of you guys. Make a Fitzpatrick. Let's go! That's boxed, man. Is that Lorenzo Carter? Hey, he's now an 89 speed linebacker, brought in in free agency. He has been a beast because he can play on the D line too. So now I played deep zones on that first play. Now I'm going to go to short zones. So now I'm going to play everything short. So my responsibility becomes these deep routes, corner routes, and I messed up. See? You mess up and you take one wrong move and you can look like an idiot real quick. Yeah, Minka, Minka. Oh, that's a laser from Mac Jones. It's got to be a, like a dive or something. Nope. Get over there, Goodwin. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm a second late. Good dog. Okay, his second drive, he made a lot better decisions. Wondell Robinson, the rookie, is going to be the throw here. Wondell. Let's go, Robinson. Nice catch. Yep. That's Justin Ross. Come on, Justin Ross! Let's go! I love this team. We are built. We are a big, tough team that's going to come into your house, run you over, leave, take all the cash, and just dip. We are, like, every one of the team. We have so many players in that, like, 6-3, 6-4 region. This guy runs a lot, so I feel like he might see this coming. So I'm actually going to flip it and run the opposite of what he thinks I'm going to do here. Good run, Najee Harris. Good run. Okay, here I'm just banking on Justin Ross being as good as he has been all year. Oh, we're boxed. I'm just giving the, I'm giving the rookie a chance. That's okay. That's honestly okay. That's gonna, Especially if he takes this out, he's got worse field position than he would have had, so... Begged. Oh my goodness. Okay. I will say in terms of rookies, he looks really good in this game right now. You know what route he wants? You know what route he wants? Can we get there? Nope. Okay, red zone D has been good like all, all year. And he, I know he's looking for a hitch here. Someone's on a hitch. Slant. Hitch. Let's go, Justin Ross. Go for a run, Justin Ross. Good stuff. Okay. This this drive, no doubt, 1,000%. I, I need seven on this. 1,000%. I got to find a way to get seven. I feel like Najee Harris can do it. He just needs one, like, really good block. Good job, Harris. This should be a house. Should be a house call. That should be a house call. Come on, Justin Ross. Oh, gosh. Okay, get. I, I'm now noticing when I move him over, he follows. So I should have a ridiculous amount of room on this left side. One guy to beat. Let's go. Go, Harris. That, my friends, is vintage Najee Harris. Let's go, my guy. Good stuff. That, that's vintage right there. That's like collector's edition vintage Najee Harris running. Okay, I, we, got, we got to put in the other running back. He's, he's exhausted. Come on. Go, Ebron. Go, Ebron. Let's go, fellas. Come on. Good job, Eric. 
Get out there, Minka. Get out there, Minka. Somebody make a play. Okay, I don't know what his game plan is here. He's playing a very Patriots type game. Running the ball a lot, being smart, not taking any huge risks. Good job, man. Fitzpatrick. Okay, where are we are okay. here? Third inches. I'm not gonna run commit, but I'm gonna blitz his face off. Come on! Oh my gosh, we got back there too. You know what he wants to throw here. You do. You know exactly what he wants to throw here. Let me. Mm, this guy's making it tough on us. Somebody get there. Oh, wow. Great freaking blocking. Holy schmoly. We got pushed way out there. Watch the run. That's all I'm going to say is don't put it past him to run this football. Don't put it past him to run this football. He is. Let's go, Minka. Good defense. The steel curtain stands up. Let's go. Needed that. I cannot tell you how big we needed that. As soon as he got to the five yard line, I was like, yo, Watt, Hayward, everybody do your thing. Huge tackle there. Okay, offense, we got this. Yeah, that's too easy. Yo, Carson, take. That's the one thing, rookie quarterbacks, IRL, and honestly, I know I'm talking about Madden, but sometimes it's difficult to just take the easy throw. I'm running the clock all the way down here. I'm going to give Najee Harris. This is. Somewhat clock manager. This is a lot. Just I need to get Najee Harris completely, completely energized and ready for this last drive. I need him to just put this team on his back like he has done so many times before and go win this for us. Good juke. Good juke. This is Harris time, baby. Harris time, baby. Let's go. Go win a ball game for us. Okay, timeout. Let him breathe a little bit. This drive entirely has been Najee Harris. Okay. I feel like the halfback draw can work. Am I confident enough going to it? I don't know. I'm definitely going to have to process this a little bit. I think I got Najee Harris in the flats. If I just snap that ball, yeah. Just throw it to him. Just throw it to him. Throw it to him. Let him rumble. Good job, Harris. Good job, Harris. Hurry it up. Time out, please. Time out. He's on his D-line. Laser! Let's go! Quick snap season. Oh, my gosh. Crossing. Let's go, ladies and gentlemen. <sighs> GG's, bro. GG's. Yo, I, I've blown so many of those games. I, I truly, truly, truly have blown so many of those games. It is a relief to get a freaking interception in crunch time. Najee Harris, take us home, my dude. Take us home. Country roads. Nine yard run. GG's 18 for 103. The beast. The beast from Alabama can, will not be stopped. And our QB, Carson Strong, two touchdowns, one pick. Bit of a rough start. Ebron had a really good game. Justin Ross played all right. No one had any crazy stat games here. This was team football. We executed beautifully to a T every single play. And we got the dub. And I will gladly take my chips with the dip. Okay, GG's. We're going to see you guys in the next week. We still have another game in this video. We got the Eagles. Let's go see how the Eagles are. Um, that's huge. That puts us to 8-4. and four, Two game lead on the division. So crucial. Can't tell you how crucial it is. In the NFC, the Eagles are 5-6. and six, So not great. Um, not going to take them lightly. But in this game, I, I know I said I subbed him in a little bit last game. In this game, you are going to see the first official start for Wandale Robinson. Um, he's been progressing decently well. And I'm, I'm going to kind of give him a chance here as a third receiver. To see how he does. I want to see if there's potential there. Honestly, I want to see how he can... He, he clearly had a nice catch last game. Not saying that I don't want to play Juju long term. We have a great receiver. I just think this is a good opportunity to kind of see what we have in Wandale Robinson. I'm going to see you guys next week. We got the Eagles. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, blah, 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 fellas. We are in week number 14 against 
the Eagles. We're getting close. It's almost playoff time, man. We are getting into that kind of closing in on playoff time range. I'm going to continue to scout uh, at the beginning of all these. I know it may seem boring, but these are players that you guys have a chance to see later uh, who could be our really, really top guy. Jeremiah Smith, good to know. Safeties, I feel really good with Edmonds. I just, I find it's good, and I would recommend to anyone, and I, because I've made this mistake before, just go and at least do a little bit of the top 100. Like the first two rounds, try and have those scouted. So that way, late in the draft, one of them sitting there, you're not going to take them like an idiot and then end up with like an eighth round grade um, type play. That's one thing I've kind of learned to avoid, and I feel like is a pretty good strategy. Going up against Eagles, 6-6 six and six is not a bad record. I know he's got a pretty tough division. Um, it's a night game at Heinz Field. That's going to be absolutely epic. Let me just say that first of all. Okay, let's do our weekly strategy first. Let's just kind of see, because you can also see. I, I want to show you guys this, which I think is kind of cool. I don't know if it really matters to you. You can see when you look at... Um, so we are the number seven ranked offense. We have the number 14 ranked rushing attack. This guy's the number 22 ranked offense. Good passing attack, bad rushing attack. Um, but he's got a really offensive, well, his offensive rank is seven. To be fair, his offensive rank is seven. Defensive rank, ours is nine. So I actually like looking at that. I never used to look at that that much, but like there's literally the answer key is there. Also, you can look at their, their report and say, okay, first and long, 18% chance. So like pretty much, Three quarters of the time, he's passing on first and long. Switch, flood. It looks like he runs bunch. This, I would say for playoff games, I don't always talk about it, but it is really good to look at because I can almost assume certainly uh, that he is running bunch or something to that effect with that. I'm going to go run outside is kind of my main thing. That That's the bread and butter of this team. That's what's got us to where we are. That's what's got us a good couple seasons uh, and has us to the top of the division. It's not anyone else. It's Najee Harris. He is the leader of this team, leader of the squad, uh, the face of the franchise, the most sold jersey in NFL history. Tell me I didn't freeze. Oh my gosh, does this to me every single time. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'm back for whatever reason. Carson Strong, baby! They're strong, and then there's Carson Strong. You guys know strong arm upgrade, always gonna be strong arm upgrade. 93 throw power. He's a good, like such a good pocket quarterback. Really, really like him. Um, Safety, we got Terrell Edmonds. He's been great over these last couple of seasons. Last year, he had a crazy interception year. He was just an absolute ball hawk. This year, he's a little more quiet, uh, but still having a quiet, good season. Okay, other than that, let's just go look at to see where we stand here with everything. In terms of stat leaders, we're still second in rushing. Um, I think Carson Strong is like near the top, but he's had a messy season. He's He's had like the biggest, like the most obvious rookie passing year ever. He's just thrown for a lot of yards, but he's thrown a lot of picks as well, which happens. Trevor Lawrence is, has, is the number one QB in the NFL right now with 40 touchdowns. That's wild. Mahomes, 51 touchdowns to two picks. We got to beat this guy, man. To get to the dance, we got to beat the Chiefs. 51 touchdowns to two interceptions. That is freaking bananas. B-A-N-A-N-A-S. Kyron Williams, who we just played uh, with 91 speed, this is the number one leading rusher in the league. Justin Ross is second in receiving. Without further ado, I think I think it's time to go play. Get this game over. Get this game against the Eagles going. Um, Jalen Hurts, not a great season. Yeah, he hasn't been playing good. Like I said, I'm starting Wandale Robinson. Gonna do everything I can to get him some touches. Just let's let's see what we have in Wandale Robinson. And I need Carson Strong to make a really good throw. Wandale! 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 Go, Wandale Robinson! Come on, let's go! Ba bam fellas! This, hey, people watch my vids. Every once in a while, it's so important in Madden, and I find for me too. When I know that I have, like, you have to be conscious of the things that you are repetitive on. Look at this play fake. Boom, he run commit. You have to try and be conscious of the things that you are repetitive on. For me, I know Play calling under center, sometimes we're repetitive. So every once in a while, I come out in a weird formation and I run a weird play. And you see the result right there. He sees I form pro, first play of the game. He's thinking Najee Harris all the way. He's the number one rusher the, over the last two years. Yo, my user fell. Edmonds. Yo, Terrell Edmonds, good play, bro. Good job by Terrell Edmonds. Okay, he's getting match coverage because right there he didn't seem overly comfortable on it. And I don't want to blitz. Okay, this is, yeah, there's a post. There's a deep post coming across that field. You got to get there. 
Oh my gosh, Minka. Minka, let's go! Once again, heavy fake, heavy fake. Boom, Wandale Robinson. Wandale! Wandale Robinson, let's go! Okay, we may have something in him. I, I don't know. He's he's just been our kick returner for the entire season. I'm not saying we do, but I'm we may just have a superstar in the making in him. Okay, get out of here, Harris. Get out of here, Harris. Let's go. 14-0. Okay, defense is the same exact thing we did last time. That's a laser. Yo! Makes an out cut late on that route. He just missed an easy touchdown. Get back there, Minka. That's a, oof. Good, good run. He had, he had a touchdown on that last play. I, I messed up. I, I thought he had a, that was a designed match beater because it absolutely torched it. Let's go home, Anderson. Throwing his hurts. You can't make that. It's a laser. That's a laser. Yo, that's a delay fade. Oh my goodness. Shake hands. Honestly, shake hands, bro. You freaking fooled me. Get out of there, Najee Harris. Yo, we need more of this, Najee Harris. We need more of that. We had that a lot in the first season. Been a little bit less of it this year. I don't know if Human Joystick has actually been good for me. Um, it's. I thought it was at the start, but lately I kind of missed. I just feel like he moves a little too fast with Human Joystick. So don't be shocked. Just run right over there. Oh, I clicked on my line by accident. That was a dead giveaway I was running. There it is. Good job, Harris. Fight. Oh my gosh. Yo, good stuff, Green. Bail him out, Green. Holy schmoly, bail him out. Okay, hard play fake, one on one. Chase Claypool. Yeah, that's that's bad decision making. On third down, he'll drop to throw. Yeah, I see you, Wandale Robinson. I see you, Wandale. And he holds on to the ball. Let's go. Here's a play fake as they set up to throw. Throw it away. Okay, whose defense is standing up? What is that? Cover, that's cover four quarters. I am going to go for this. It's no man's land. But I, I do feel like I'm my best choice here is to go for it. I'm going to get a little extra blocking because his D-line has been creating a stupid amount of pressure on us. I'm looking Wandale to Justin. I got a nice double team there. Wandale, I don't know what happened to his route. Let's go, Edmonds! Holy wow, he attacks the ball. That's a laser. That this guy has a losing record. I'm gonna say that first, but he is playing better than. Ooh, he clearly knows what he's doing. Yo, play it. Let's go. Good job, D-line. D-line, you baby. Good job. Okay. I'm screaming at him here. He's got to make a good read. Like, you got to make a good fast read. Laser pointer. I said that doesn't make sense defensive-wise, but good job, Minka. I said every once in a while, I just go old school, like 1950s football with Najee Harris. And I just trust him to make people miss, do crazy jukes, and get like 15 a pop. He's having a very, very, very good season. Okay, back to the ground game. Yeah, there's Najee Harris. That's vintage, baby. That's vintage Steeler football. I gotta, I gotta order his jersey. That's a laser. That's wide open. I don't know if that's a design combo, um, if he knew that that would work, but if he did, power to you. That's a beautiful, beautiful red zone match beating combo. I had nobody to follow him. Okay, you got him. Send Watt, send Watt, his box, bro. Yeah. Anderson! 
Holy yo, if I could somehow. Yo, laser, Eric, Ebron, let's go, Ebron! Good catch. Carson Strong has been far from beautiful on this game. He's had a bit of a tough go. Great start, but a bit messy. I'm, I'm taking the touchdown passes he needs at Najee Harris. It's a good throw. Good play. Good play, shoot. And this doesn't work. The Steelers recover it. They'll look to throw. Flush to his right. There he is, Justin Ross. Good catch, Justin. Laser. Oh, that's so open. It's not even funny. Don't blitz me, bro. Let's go, Najee Harris. Let's go. Everybody eats, man. Everybody eats. Good pick, good way. Laser, laser. Good throw, Carson. That's the thing on this team I've been doing all year, which you don't see in a lot of men. I honestly think it's realistic. I have so much hype on my squad with Ebron, Claypool, Justin Ross. Wandale Robinson played really, really, really good in his debut. What did he have? He had 127, three catches. He was good last game, too. I, I think we got a superstar in the making. I do want to look a lot at defensive rookie of the year because I do think... We have a chance with Anderson. I think Anderson's having a quietly amazing year. And I, I would be shocked if he's not at least a little bit in contention. So let's just go to stats and awards and see kind of where we stand on a couple of these. Uh, that's going to help out Carson Strong a little bit in the NFL. Okay, so MVP. Yo, Najee Harris has got another. He's second for MVP. Oh, my gosh. He's got a chance to go back to back. Okay. AFC Offensive Player of the Year. Off D yo, shout out Minka, shout out Minka, offensive rookie of the year, Carson Strong's third, Justin Ross is fourth. Yo, let's go. Okay. If he can win that, Adam Anderson's gonna become a superstar. Just process that. Just process that. We would have two superstars on that side. I gotta look, and that's before. He was number one for that before we even like that's not taking into account the game that he just played. If you look at Adam Anderson, 17 tackles, 10 for loss, 5 sacks, and 4 interceptions. He's done a little bit of everything on this team. He's been really, really, really good. Minka Fitzpatrick is up for Defensive Player of the Year. He's got 10 interceptions. He's went crazy. 46 tackles. He's had a good year. OB Edmonds has played really, really well. Is oh Dang, man. Yo, we're looking good. Okay, let's look at the situation real quick and kind of see what we got for our remaining games. We got four games left, which you guys are going to be seeing in the next video. I'm excited. I cannot wait. Uh, we got to end this season strong, make it to the playoffs, do our thing. We got the league leading rusher again with 1,251 yards with Najee Harris. Ladies and gentlemen, see you all next time. Kill the like button.